can record. All right. Good afternoon. I will call to order the meeting of the Greenwood Stormwater Board. It's Wednesday, January 12, 2022. And it's four o'clock. Can we have a roll call, please? David Payne. Here. Tim McLaughlin. Here. Forrest Sutton. Here. All right. She's all present. Um, We'll uh, entertain a motion for approval of our minutes from our last meeting of December 8th, 2021. I'll make that motion. Second. Uh, any discussion about the minutes? No, sir. All right. All in favor say aye. 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 So the minutes being approved. All right. Is there anything under old business? Uh, no, nothing for under old business. New business. We'll move right along. Okay. Uh, for the record, Chris Jones, so our superintendent. First item we have is the 2022 Lake, uh, Lakeview Pond Care Treatment with ASAP, ASAP Aquatics. Uh, we have a slight increase uh, this year, uh, but we want to go ahead and continue uh, with that program. Uh, the amount is $2,580. Uh, recommended approval or terms and conditions. Uh, the outline of the legal department and authorized the stormwater superintendent to sign on the board of the Is there a motion? I make the motion. I'll second. All right. Motion and a second. You remember what last year's price was? It was within a hundred dollars of this. Any discussion about the motion? No. All right. All in favor of the motion say aye. 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 The motion is being approved. All right. Okay, next item. Oh, let me get my, got some things on the screen to show. This is contract Cooley Construction. Uh, it's, it's, it's a line of a mantle. If you see, this is on the Smith Valley Bypass. Uh, this has been a troubled spot for for years, even when we first started, um, there was a uh, you know, fence around it, and um, it's kind of an obstacle with the extra utilities in there. So it's it's in the number fifty one ninety three. Uh, we've passed it a few times, and we think that we either would need to replace the entire thing, or we're going to go this route, and we're going to try to have a line. Uh, so Cooley uh, has provide us with an estimate uh, to line this manhole uh, in an amount of exceeding $5,744.00. So I recommend the motion uh, that we accept this estimate uh, at the legal department, specify terms conditions, and authorize the school or superintendent to sign the board behalf. So your motion is to approve a contract. Approve the contract. Yeah. Approve a contract with tonight. Contracting for the Smith Valley Bypass Manhole Pipe Repair. Terms and conditions to be determined by the legal department authorizes the superintendent to sign, and it will be in an amount not to exceed five thousand seven hundred forty-four dollars. All right. Is there a motion? I'll make that motion. Second motion. All right. Any other discussion? No. All right. Hearing none. All in favor, say aye. 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 That's being approved. Okay, I actually have two additional add-ons. Uh, first one being, uh, I presented to the board at last month's meeting, uh, and we continue to fill this one. Uh, it's a uh, agreement with KK Fence. Uh, what we we're wanting to do is update our, just the front, fence here at the nature center uh, testing lab to match what is across the street so that's what's across the street what we do is just replace just the front section so that way we keep the, the side in the back uh, but that way we'd be in uh, I, I say compliance but we'd be aesthetically in compliance with uh, everything else that we're improving here down the city so if you recall the uh to get an eight foot tall fence with a sliding gate. Uh, the proposal uh, we received from KK Fence uh, is $27,890.00. So I would recommend a motion uh, to have 
legal uh, department draft a contract with Kane and Kane Fence for the installation of the fence and gate across the front of 225 South Washington Street. The amount not to exceed $27,890.00. I'll write the stormwater superintendent to sign the boards we have. I'll make that motion. Second. Second. Um, oh. Much fencing, but we, what is the width of that, you know? Uh, yes, 190. Well, we know that, I know there's been years ago previous discussions about maybe we're going to have that property or not. Anything else you've heard about that? Uh, no, I, I think, you know, we've uh, presented to the uh, the mayor an opportunity or uh, an estimate to have the site for the, the brick building, um, get architect architectural drawings, um, and to improve the bathrooms. And so, right now, the mayor's uh, been out uh, for uh, personal reasons, and uh, we're hoping that come February we'll, uh, we'll hear from him then. But uh, until then, uh, it, it looks like we're going to with our education outreach using that brick building um, and of course to create an outside classroom this year. Uh, all right, so we have a motion second. Any other discussion? No, sir. All right. All in favor say aye. 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 It's being approved. Okay, here's a here's a blank screen. Uh, my was not going out. Okay, so I also sent to the board uh, my second item uh, was the solar panels. And if you recall, the, uh, the board approved last year to install solar panels on the brick, brick building at the Nature Center. Uh, we've held off on doing that until we can finalize uh, any construction plans that we have in the building. So. Uh, We've asked the, the same company to provide us with an estimate to put um, solar panels on our solar on the lift station that, that is at 615 West Fifth Valley. So that's over there, Tracy Ditch, over by, by the high school. Uh, we think that it would be a, a good uh, use of uh, solar panels or solar technology. Um, if you see in the proposal that they provided to us, uh, the uh, the solar panels will create 10,080 kilowatts a year, uh, approximately. Uh, so that would, if we extrapolate the numbers we've got so far, that would be uh, between five and six months of electrical usage. Uh, <coughs> yeah. So uh, we think it might be, you know, a good one, good optics, um, and you know, for Green technology and um, uh, in order to you know offset the cost, uh, if you see um, their proposal, uh, they state that the system will pay for itself in 12 years. That would be the return on investment. Um, as I mentioned, I, I think it's a good uh, opportunity for us to uh, continue with our our green uh, green uh, uh, initiatives uh, with the with the utility. So I would recommend a motion uh, that we direct legal to prepare uh, an agreement with the Jefferson Electric for solar panels for the lift station at 615 uh, Smith Valley Road in a mountain lot to see $11,299.00. I'll authorize the floor superintendent to sign the board we have. Motion. Yeah, I, I do have a question. Is there a backup to those generator or? Uh, well, it's it's currently on uh, on new power. That's so okay. A, a monthly utility bill. And that will continue to be. We will continue to have a utility bill. It will just be at a reduced price. So we won't use as much. Okay. I'll make that motion. I'll okay. second. All right. So I'm assuming that if we wanted to. Provide all the power through solar, have to double the size of this. We would have to, yes. It'd be a huge, right? So the 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 area that um, uh, initially we thought about 
building something above the lift station. Uh -huh. um, that was going to, we, we, we looked at ways to do that and the prices. And it just, it was, it, that was almost kind of double because we need a stout steel structure to hold the. So this is going to be a 12 by 12 area that we're going to put just on the other side. So it'll still be within our, our easement and uh, we'll push the next thing in that area. Yeah. Is that area protected in any way? Is that area where it's going to be protected in any way? Like fencing or anything? No. Okay. No. Um, we'll, 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 we'll see how this goes. Yeah. Uh, do we have a motion and second? Any other discussion? All right. Do all in favor say aye. 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 That's all I had to do. Okay. Um, anybody from the audience outside of our industry uh, person? So, reports. Any bar council? No, sir. Okay. Let's see, city engineer. Anybody on Zoom? I think so. Okay. Mr. Control or anything? Nothing for me. All right. Thank you. All right, Chris. All right, back to me. All right. So, we do have. Couple of manuals. All right, operation maintenance manuals. Okay, so the first one is Medical Behavioral Hospital of Indianapolis. Uh, this ODA manual has been reviewed by staff and we find it to be acceptable, so I recommend a motion uh, to accept the manual and authorize the mayor to sign the board to that. The motion. So moved. And all in favor, say aye. 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 The second panel is for Swartz Crossing Commercial. Uh, staff has reviewed this ONA manual, found it to be acceptable, and we recommend a motion to accept the manual and authorize the mayor to sign the board's behalf. Motion. So moved. Second. All in favor, say aye. 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 Okay, the third and last one. Uh, Flats and Stones Crossing. Uh, staff has reviewed this operation maintenance manual, find it to be acceptable. I recommend a motion to accept the manual and authorize the mayor to sign on board behalf. Your motion. So moved. Second. All, right. All in favor say aye. 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 Okay, on to the reports. Uh, so for the month of December, they did 3.75 tons of debris for street sweeping. Uh, we had 4.19 inches of precipitation. Average temperature is high, 43.2. We had 76 work orders initiated, 57 completed, 22 requests initiated, 21 completed, 1,647 locates, 10 erosion center control permits issued, 88 erosion center control inspections, 42 hotspots cleared, 2 VAP inspections. And back to track, we worked on Yorktown Road, Kingsley Pond, or Rain Maps, and we jetted 217.49 feet that month. Uh, other things going on in the department are right of way locator uh, position. So we, we transitioned our two locators into right of way, uh, right of way and locator inspectors. Uh, so our new uh, members started on uh, January 3rd. Uh, and we're, yeah, we're in a training um, mode right now, and um, we, we're going to hit the ground running as soon as we start getting more private uh, permits. That's all I got. We do not see anybody from the mayor's office. Uh, commissioners, do you have anything? I don't. No, no sir. All right. And I will accept the motion for approval of our claim dockets. I would make that. Okay. Second the motion. Uh, all in favor say aye. 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 All right. Anything else that needs to come before the board? Oh, the board did get the quarterly report from finance. Yeah. All right. That's all. Anything else? Stand adjourned at 4.15. Sorry.